Hey everybody, Prepper Nurse One here. There's videos on my phone, so I don't know how well you're going to be able to see everything. But uh, I am down here at a shipping container place, and I'm going to show you the uh, shipping container that I just bought. <laughs> um, this is going to go out uh, by the road, and uh, so it is... Uh, I'm going to go around the back here and I will show you the shipping container. But, uh, oh, they got logs. Hmm. wonder if I should <laughs> go ahead and, uh, I'm going to probably pick them up. I'll get them. Right here, Zim. <laughs> uh, this is going to be my shipping container. So they are going to be delivering this to me next week. And, uh, you know, it's a used shipping container, obviously. And uh, so there it is. I'll show you the front of it. I'm not going to open it up because it don't matter at the moment. But, uh, yeah, so that is the shipping container. And uh, so I'm pretty happy about that. Uh, it's going to be... That's going to go by the road because that'll be where I'm going to be storing the bike um, and some supplies, obviously. But, uh, yeah, it's uh, pretty excited. <laughs> Spending money like a fool, actually, to be honest with you. But that's okay. It's all part of what has to be done. Uh, it's all steps in the right direction. As soon as the, uh, you know, the property is paid off, these will be, or as soon as the property in New York is sold, all this will get paid off anyway, so. But I need to have things in place, and that's why I'm down here um, on this trip uh, to facilitate that. And uh, so here I am. I'm like, oh, and I did also. Um, I uh, actually, if you you'll if you look on my Instagram and Twitter, you will see uh, uh, IBC tote. I bought two IBC tote, 250 gallon IBC totes as well, and. Uh, they're gonna put them just right inside the shipping container and bring them when they when they bring them on Wednesday. So uh, yeah, so that's it. Uh, you know we're uh, making progress. I'll turn this this way so you got. There we go. There's a little bit better. Let's see, it's a 20 foot long uh, shipping container. Let me see. Let me open this up here. Hold on. Does this? Oh, there we go. All right. So here's the inside. <clears throat> I better figure out how it works, right? <laughs> but uh, yeah, it looks good. Um, obviously, it's used, and that's uh, that's what you know. But uh, this will be something that will absolutely work. Uh, on the homestead and like I said I'll uh, use this for my motorcycle uh, other storage obviously in the meantime so as I'm bringing stuff down so once this is down here a lot of the stuff that I have right now um, there, sorry about the echo I'll step back out of here um, but when I hold on one second guys with me Give me one second, folks. I'm just trying to <laughs> get this back to uh, well, I'll do that in a second. Oh, there's a stone right there. That's why. There we go. I was wondering what the issue is. 
All right, so that's that. Um, I also purchased a lock for this as well. Uh, so, you know, that's, uh, that's where we're at. But uh, anyway, um, before I leave on this trip to head back to New York, I will be able to put, you know, everything um, that's important that I don't want to have disappear um, in here. And so that's going to work out really, really well. And then when I come down with my next load, I can really load up that trailer, uh, you know, and uh, the truck and, uh, you know, and go from there. But uh, pretty excited about it. It's going to be a very good addition. And uh, it's going to make a big, big difference um, in what we're doing, you know, with everything moving forward. So just another step, and I'm going to turn this again this way so you guys can see this better. Uh, another good step in the direction of getting things done. So I'm really, really happy. Uh, the IBC totes are going to come in super handy as well, obviously for water storage. It's going to make a big, big difference. Um, and yes, if you're seeing this here as we're standing here, you are seeing snow showers. Um, it's much colder today. Yesterday, I will tell you this. So yesterday I had the air conditioning on um, in the camper because it got 80 degrees. So I turned the air conditioning on in the camper. And uh, today I woke up this morning and I was like, well, let me turn the heat on. <laughs> <laughs> so one of those kind of things guys but anyway so real quick i want to remind everybody i will be live streaming tonight uh 8 p.m eastern time so i would encourage you all to join me then and uh, we'll have a good discussion that way and uh looking forward to that as well and i'm not sure what the topic is going to be yet i have to set that up but we will get that squared away but uh making progress uh making this a productive trip which was the whole goal of this anyway uh, you can't do these things without without being here so being here and getting things done and getting this i, I it's a, just a huge step uh puts us in the right direction with everything that we want to do so anyway real quick i want to mention my website preppernurse1.com we have the Prepper Nurse One community there, which is a resource that we have set up for you guys to be able to connect with like-minded people. It is free to join, but you do have to register, but it doesn't cost anything. No credit card information is asked. Uh, and once you're in, check out the message boards. Also check out, uh, you know, for, for people in your state or in your country. All right. So I'm going to look around at the other side of this real quick, if we can. I don't know if it's close enough to the other one or not yeah okay we can see it yeah so it's got some dents and dings and bings in it but uh it's not not bad at all uh also um on my website preppernurse1.com you will see the um uh leg or not i'm sorry the uh forefathers which is the cbd and hemp store it's in there's the back um the cbd and hemp store and so if you check that out uh, you click on their link or their logo on my website, it will take you to their web page. Once you're on their web page, uh, if you decide to make a CBD or hemp purchase, make sure you use the discount code Prepper Nurse One. All right. Uh, also on my website, we have the Legacy Freeze Dried Foods. Uh, again, PrepperNurse1.com. You click on store, it will drop down. You will see the Legacy Foods. You click on that, and you um, can uh, make a purchase within this. You know their uh, 25 year shelf life, uh, GMO free, gluten options are available for people that need that as well. Uh, it is also the largest portion size of any of the other freeze dried food companies. It is also made in the United States. Uh, so definitely take advantage of that. All right. Uh, so anyway, guys, I am going to jump off of here for now. I'm going to get out of here because it's freaking freezing, but I'm excited. We got a shipping container, a step in the right direction. Uh, remember we are all in this together. We are one race called the human race. As soon as we can figure that out, we are going to absolutely be in much, much better shape. Uh, stop letting them divide us over race, religion, political affiliation, the vax, the unvax. Don't let them do that. All right. Uh, stay positive. Stay away from the negativity. Like I said, and you're going to be just you're going to be good to go with that. Uh, but anyway, also remember to hug and kiss the ones that you love. 
tell them every single day tomorrow is not guaranteed we never know what's going to happen in life so it's really important that we tell the people that we care about every day how we feel last but not least std step thing and day one step at a time one thing at a time and one day at a time whatever you are trying to do whatever you are trying to accomplish you can do it the only one that's going to stop you from reaching your goals is you that's it nobody else stay positive stay away from the negativity and you're going to be just fine all right i will see you all later have a great day. Prepper Nurse One, out for now.